What are some options to recover an Optima or any AGM battery that is difficult to recharge? The most common reason an Optima battery may have difficulty recharging is if it is deeply discharged or if it has been stored without a proper charge. We're going to talk about some options that will recover most deeply discharged batteries. The best method for consumers to maximize AGM battery performance or to recover a deeply discharged battery is to use a modern AGM specific battery charger like the new Optima Chargers Digital 1200 12 volt battery charger and maintainer. This charger was specifically designed by Optima to enhance the charging characteristics of Optima batteries and for that matter, all high performance AGM batteries. It will also charge regular lead acid batteries and recover deeply discharged batteries. We do not officially endorse specific chargers outside of our own. However, we understand there are many chargers on the market to choose from. Chargers with AGM compatibility are becoming more common and they work great for all lead acid batteries. In most cases, these chargers will recover deeply discharged AGM batteries as well. For many of you who still own and use an older style analog charger, you may still be able to recover a deeply discharged battery. If an Optima battery is deeply discharged below 10 and half volts, many basic battery chargers will not supply a charge. An Optima may not recharge to its maximum performance if treated as a regular flooded or gel battery. To charge a deeply discharged battery, you can wire a second fully charged automotive battery, like this one here, to the discharged Optima battery and wire them in parallel. Then hook up your conventional battery charger to the discharged battery. Set the charger for 10 amps. When the battery has been deeply discharged, some sulfation of the battery plates may have occurred. If you charge at 10 amps, the higher current will help break up the sulfation. After you've hooked up the battery charger, let it charge for two hours, monitoring it frequently. When the discharge battery reaches 10 and half volts or more, remove the second battery and continue charging the AGM battery until it's fully charged. If you have an automatic battery charger, let it run until the charger indicates charging is complete. If you have a manual charger, estimate charging time based on the capacity of the battery. In most cases, this step will recover the AGM battery. It's okay for the AGM battery to get slightly warm during the charging process, but hot to the touch means there could be a short and the process should be discontinued. There are other tricks to recovering deeply discharged batteries, but some are not safe for the typical consumer. If you're someone who just simply doesn't want to hassle with their battery, exercise option three, and that's to take the battery to a professional battery specialist who knows AGM technology. Most of them are willing to provide charge and check procedures for a very small fee, and many of them will provide the service for free. Battery specialists are experts that can help determine if your battery is recoverable or not. In conclusion, the scenarios and options I just outlined should cover the majority of all deeply discharged automotive batteries.